What's up everyone? Welcome to the channel and here we have Marvel Studios Moon Knight official trailer from Disney Plus. We are continuing the MCU saga with phase four and within phase four we've we're getting some really good TV series, eh, some of them not so good, <laughs> which I will um, get into further on in the next two bumps because uh, I've got a whole backlog of MCU content that I've not reviewed yet. I've seen most of that, the TV series, um, except for What If and Loki. So, and with this, Moon Knight, I vaguely know a few things about the character. I understand that he is meant to be this algamation of Punisher and Batman. So he's got that mean streak in him of being an anti-hero, which is something interesting. Um, interesting in how we're going to see how Marvel is going to deal with those themes of his character. So, let's dive into it. Let's see what they have to offer. Hello, and welcome to Staying Awake. I have a sleeping disorder. I can't tell the difference between my waking life and dreams. Hello, and welcome to Staying Awake. Uh, <laughs> Looking cool, so I think I'm losing it. We'll catch you. Everyone's been there. You're bloody useless. Stevie. Steven. Still shit faced from the night before. I can't tell the difference between my eyes and dreams. dreams. Thank you. Playing into those psychological themes there. Hope you find it. Thanks. Good English accent. Yeah. Oh my god, you're alive. What's wrong with you, Mark? Why did you call me Mark? It must be very difficult. The voice is in your head. Shut up! There's chaos in you. Nice way to pull it off there. Hey, it's looking good. Hey, look, all I'm saying is I can't believe we're getting I'm, ve I, I'm vengeance and embrace the chaos all in March. Look, with this, just give me f three of these episodes right off the bat, straight away. Let me dive in. Let this show engross me i want to be there fully locked in with my super malt and my popcorn and just enjoy this you know it's yeah it's definitely leaning into its psychological thriller tendencies and what's really interesting about this and i hope that this trailer hasn't just done this for face value like as if you know you know this is what the theme you know, is and then just subvert your expectations. I don't want that to happen. I want it to be like this. And something, there is something clever about this character if they're able to nail it. And from what I've seen, with the elements of its character development of the alter ego taking up these decisions to do these certain things, whereas. My, um, the character I, Oscar Isaac is playing, obviously there's ramifications and consequences from this alter ego going out 
as this vigilante beating the shit out of everyone. And then how does that then correlate to his normal life? He hasn't got a normal life then, you know? So it's interesting and I hope it goes there. I hope that the show is grounded. I hope that it is a little bit dark, you know? As we've seen with the recent um, rating of the Batman, that, that looks like it's pushing its PG-13, 12A rating as as hard as it can be po possibly be pushed. And I hope that this as well does push the envelope with its storytelling. And who knows, it could be the best MCU series to date. You know, I mean, overall, the best Marvel show, in my opinion, is Daredevil. But, you know, agree to disagree. But I think I'll find many people that would agree with me. But guys, what do you think of this, which is the main question? And if you enjoyed your time here, leave a like on the video, helps the channel out. Check out the descri description for more content. And always... Thank you. I love you. I appreciate you. And I'll see you in the next video.